good morning everybody now in that uh, theme national diversity that b reading before uh, going towards that national diversity a plea for india plea means request a request for india it means to india's uh, people we indians are proud to be a strong nation we indians are proud to be a strong nation our roots we declare cannot be shaken we proudly declare that our roots cannot be shaken then why these uh, fights then why these uh, fights the fights may be of uh, any nature B because of that uh, uh, caste differences or um, communal differences or rich poor differences or any other differences why these uh, fights once we proudly declare that uh, we are very strong nation which leave us in poor plight okay certainly these uh, fights uh, leave us in poor condition that is poor plight irrespective of our region forget the caste which make us lose our charm so these differences uh, may make us lose our charm they make us lose our charm otherwise we are very charming but because of these uh, fights we are losing our charm let us ignore the selfish color of uh, each region no doubt uh, each and every region being so selfish they are giving that uh, uh, selfish call so let us ignore that uh, selfish call of the region keeping the uh, big picture in the mind that is uh, country and uh, listen for one, uh, once to the call of the nation by ignoring the uh, regional call let us listen to the call of the nation why do we spend our time bickering it means uh, spending time uselessly discussing unnecessary unwanted useless things when so many uh, tasks need finishing when there are so many tasks that are to be finished why we waste our time in discussing all these uh, useless uh, things don't we have better things to do it does mean that yes we have uh, better things to do then indulge in creating problems a new a new it means instead of creating problems a new it means those problems have not been but as if okay um, we are troubled by those things we are cre creating those problems a new why we should create those uh, problems a fresh a new is, is all this violence needed is all this violence needed certainly this violence is not needed with the people being cheated people are getting uh, cheated people are being cheated people cheat people so why this cheating why this violence are they needed equal to they are not needed so this is the uh, request for people and for people of uh, india who will return this uh, only son okay a mother uh, lost her son in the um, battlefield the borders of the nation who would bring that uh, lost son, uh, son to that uh, waiting mother whom she loves a ton that mother uh, loves the son a ton that uh, um loving son okay lovable son who would bring that uh, son back to that uh, waiting mother okay um who son uh, lost his life in that uh, border okay fighting a war against the enemy country who will bring back his brother whose ashes he still together somewhere a brother has lost his uh, brother and this uh, brother is waiting for the ashes of that uh, dead brother why this uh, 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 cases and why this uh, violence why these uh, wars why these uh, fights once we say that uh, we are very proud and we are very strong because our roots uh, cannot be shaken as they are deeply rooted <coughs> where has all the love gone okay where has all the love gone the reason for all these uh, negative things is and he says the poet says that uh, the existing love that has uh, gone where has all that uh, love gone it does mean that if that love existed no doubt all these things would not uh, uh, happen and that waiting mother uh, didn't have to wait for her uh, son <coughs> so which resided in the uh, hearts of uh, all there is no reason to be proud and uh, be on high cloud once this is the bad condition uh, practically on the ground how can we feel proud and be on the high cloud being on the high cloud does mean that uh, feeling very very happy that is the meaning of being on high cloud we have to go a long way no doubt we have to go a long way we have to think seriously uh, else we end up miserably no doubt we have to think seriously otherwise else okay we will end up miserably 
and our strength and our history and uh, our greatness would be a matter of history okay it was but not is in that way we have to fail miserably unless we act seriously so if we think and act seriously no doubt we don't have to uh, end up ourselves in misery then let our minds uh, throw out the rot rot means the uh, negative feelings and that enmity that jealousy we have towards the others okay let mm, us get rid of that uh, enmity uh, let us uh, get rid of that uh, thing from our uh, rotting mind and devote our time to pious uh, thoughts let us control the rights r i o t s okay let us control those uh, uh, rights that is uh, particularly communal rights and all which leave us okay with uh, no choice they leave us with uh, no choice the only choice we would be left with is hanging our heads uh, in shame declaring that uh, most civilized civilized nation in the world or one of the most civilized nations in the world and uh, very strong cultural uh, roots and a very um, rich cultural heritage declaring all those uh, things but uh, involving in those communal uh, rights and all no doubt we only would be having only one choice that is uh, hanging our heads uh, in shame which leave us with no choice but to hang our heads in shame and say we have miserably failed of course we only have to say that we have miserably failed our failure is very miserable <coughs> we have the power to win no doubt okay the other side of the coin the positive side is no doubt we have to we can okay uh, win the uh, war against such a rights and all and we have that power to win so why not end this uh, din why not end this uh, uh, troubling okay brining and deafening noise so once we have that uh, power to win why don't we bring that uh, power that is inherent in us with with which we can win war okay again it's such a uh, attitudes and all okay um, which are the reason, main principal reasons for this uh, rights and all let us unite and fight against those who inside no doubt okay we are uh, cooperative doesn't mean that uh, the cooperative hand and uh, the helping hand the other hand would be extended um to uh, for us to uh, shake their hands no doubt there would always be people and countries okay they are ready to uh, cause um, problems to us and they would uh, inside inside means poking the people uh, to cause violence and all okay against that uh, insiders let us uh, unite let us not be misled let us not be misled by those uh, people who want to see us dead death doesn't mean that physical death uh, our culture and our uh, what is that uh, values our uh, um, the values we give to our ourselves and our country and what make make us what we are okay so killing that the soul of that is country that is their goal it is, he is not talking the poet is not talking about physical death and all so they want okay the life of this country the soul of this country the core of this country thinking uh, about which the country feels so proud and all okay because here in this uh, part of the land uh, that wonderful concept called vasudhaiva kutumbakam that is uh, world is one family has uh, been originated okay such uh, soul stirring okay uh, qualities uh, this uh, country enjoys such qualities are to be uh, <coughs> what is that killed okay that is the idea of those uh, insiders against those insiders Uh, insiders okay let us be united and uh, fight against uh, those so who want to see us uh, dead please understand here dead doesn't mean that physical death okay we are so strong uh, as a na- united nations and we need uh, what we need is a bit of a uh, dedication no doubt our nation is very very strong what actually we need is a bit of a uh, a bit of he is not asking much a bit of dedication from each and every indian because this country okay as uh, it is uh, <coughs> blessed with uh, 130 crore uh, people no doubt a bit of dedication from each and every indian no doubt uh, would make this uh, strong nation further stronger and further stronger and further stronger so we are never interested in uh, becoming the strongest nation in the conventional sense of the world we want to become the strongest nation uh, culturally and uh, spiritually which we are but that is to be strengthened further by 
uh, a bit of a dedication that uh, is asked of from each and every Indian by this uh, poet that is about uh, a plea for India. A plea means request. Okay, the poet is requesting uh, India. It uh, means uh, all Indians uh, to give a bit of uh, dedication in order to uh, bring that um, strength that is already there to make it uh, more strong. Okay, culturally, in order um, that the other countries would look towards this country uh, to learn what uh, we can offer to them. In that sense, no doubt, it is a very rich country that is a spiritual. Thank you. Thank you so much. Take care.